Hello fellow Wastelanders, in today's video I will be showing you how to get brain bombs in Fallout 76. So, let's get into it. The first thing you want wanting to do is go to per cards. You want green top and perception. This allows you to get double fruit when you collect it. You want through hiker and agility so your food base less. You want super duper so you can get more of these items when you craft it and you want good but salt so it doesn't spoil one of the items you're going to require is Baxwood Man 4 this gives you 50% chance to get double the plants when you collect it so if you have any of these water purifiers in your camp please put it down because this allows you to get purified water for one of these steps to make brain bombs so, another good thing to have is this Mothman nest. It gives you three Mothman eggs each 15 minutes, if I'm correct. And this allows you to make brain bombs really fast if you do not want to go grind Mothman eggs. So, as you can see, we need brain fungus, Mothman eggs, purified water, sugar bombs, and wood. So, let's get into it. You want to come to Thunder Mountain Substation. Yeah, in the cranberry bog so you want to follow exactly where i'm going you're going to go into a tunnel and this is where you're going to find the brain fungus i will speed up this video so it doesn't take a lot of time If you do see this door, proceed to go through it because there's more brain fungus behind it. Now this is the end and now we're gonna TP to the next place. So let's go. So Point Pleasant is gonna be the next place. This is where you're gonna collect Mothman eggs. And this does not stack with Back Boots Man 4 and green thumb so you only get one egg per a pickup so there will be cultists here what you're gonna fight they're really easy to fight but you want to follow me down to this table there's gonna be a bit of mothman eggs here they like in this little patches so try and collect all of them and then there's one more place close by so you just want to run up here where this arrow is you want to go through it and you will see this little statue of a mothman around it should be mothman eggs try and collect all of them there will be a lot here okay let's see how much mothman eggs we collected from point pleasant we collected a total of 39 Mothman eggs from point place it. So let's go to the next place. The next place is going to be Clancy Manor. This is where we're going to collect some more Mothman eggs. So you want to run to this house. There's a lot of cultists as well in here. So let's get to where the Mothman eggs are. So you want to enter through this little Mothman, I'm just going to say door here, but yeah going to basically go inside there is a few cultists in here i was just checking for something in this bush main place where the mothman eggs are going to be is right here on this wall as you can see there should be three here or two there's a few in here as well and then on the floor the next place we're going to go is upstairs so there's this little bedroom where you want to go this is where you're going to find more Mothman eggs. It should, we should be getting a total of 44 Mothman eggs to, I think, 48 out of this. So, let's get to the next place. The next place we want to go to is Camden Park. So, you just want to follow me because this is where we're going to get the key so we can get some sugar bombs from the next place. So just follow me completely. If you do not have this jumping ability with the 
serums, then just go around until you see this roller coaster. You want to get onto the roller coaster and basically run through here so you can get to the key. There usually spawns a bubble head here, so try and get it. Uh, and then you want to keep on running all the way until you get to this carts. So this is where the key is going to be. It should be in this backpack in the front. And this is what we're going to use to go to the next place. So let's get to the next place. You want to go to New River George Bridge West. This is where we're going to get the brain bombs. If you don't have a jetpack, just run around. There should be some stairs. But you want to go up here. There should be some ferricles, but try and kill them. And then go through this door. I usually close it so they can't come through. They should spawn one to three sugar bombs right here. So let's get to the next place. The next place is Moss Tower. So you would usually spawn right here just run to your left a bit and you should see this house but what is alone so there should be a door what i'm going to show you guys and you guys are going to go into there the sugar bombs usually spawn in the bathtub they spawns about one to six sugar bombs in this location so let's get to the next location so the last location is going to be Summersville. This is if you want to reset everything you have collected so you can get new items. So you want to go into this place and basically kill all the feral ghouls what is in here. Please do not kill them with the explosive weapons because this is going to allow the books to go fly. I will show you a way how to reset the books if you use an explosive weapon like me. As you can see, all the books went around the place. The place you want to go is to Overseer's house. TP then, TP back. There should be a total of 286 books what you want to collect. If you can't collect them, just rejoin a new server and then collect them. And then join a new server and then the items should respawn. You also make sure to scrap them. So... I hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you do, like and subscribe.